Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to create these dip dye star studded shorts. So if you guys are excited on basically learning how to make these shorts, keep watching. So what you're going to be needing is dye. I'm using Rit Liquid Dye and the colors I chose is Cherry Red and Aqua Marine. Um, you're also going to be needing star studs or pungs, salt, um, a pair of gloves, two rubber bands and of course a large um, Ziploc bag. You're going to be using two um, containers for your dye bath you're going to be creating and then of course your shorts. First thing you're going to have to boil water and while you're boiling water you can take your Ziploc bag and cut off the end of the Ziploc bag and the top part of the Ziploc bag. You're going to take your shorts and you're going to gather it at the center and make sure that it is even from the top and bottom. And then you're going to take the shorts and slip them through the Ziploc bag tunnel, gather it around the shorts as well. Then you're going to take your first rubber band and you're going to tie the top middle part of the plastic tight as tight as you can because you are going to create a top, middle, and a bottom. So do this for the bottom. Once you are finished with that, you should have a top, middle, and bottom portion when you're ready to go ahead and dip it. Pour the boiling water into the dye baths and then you're going to add in your dye. So when you're adding your dye, since I'm using liquid, it's not necessary for me to use like half of the bottle. I just use a little bit enough to completely saturate the water so I won't see um, a lighter color of it. So once I see that it's saturated, I know it's enough. I don't need to put in a lot. And you do it for the blue. And then once that's done, you go ahead and add salt. You need to add four to five spoons full of salt. Prep up your hands with the gloves and then you're ready to dye. So you're going to dip one end of the shorts into one color. I would suggest you to do the light first and then work your way to the red. You should leave your dye, the dip dyes, in for like about five minutes each color. The longer you keep it, the more saturated it will be. Rinse out each end thoroughly with cold or cool water and make sure that the water turn clear at the very end. Take it apart and see what it looks like. Once you see that it's separated, you know, everything's fine, then you can go get back again and wash it accordingly and try to make sure that you get every single thing out. Once you rinse everything out, just get on the hanger and let it dry. So once you're fully dried, everything is out, now it's time to stud. That is the best fun part. Okay, so um, I'm using these stars, so I'm basically going to lay everything out so I can see what I want. It's up to you to decide how you want your layout. I figured I want it to be like some type of like falling stars, sort of American flag 
ish looking so um, I decided to lay them out and see what it looks like and then stud them up so have fun with it and make it your own This is the final result of the shorts. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and you gave it a try. Thanks for watching. Like it, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.